Hey guys, welcome back to my channel here. This is Pedro Fame, and we're back with another one here. And we're gonna be playing against Mississippi State today here in episode three. Um, probably gonna it's gonna be a two piece episode today. So two games are gonna be happening today. Um, this has absolutely uh, been a pretty good series. Um, not really viewer wise, but it's been pretty fun for me to do this. Um, I know it's gonna take a while for this series to take off. So I'm actually gonna play the long game. Keep doing this on YouTube for a little while. Um, if it doesn't just do well after, like at the end of the first season, if I don't see like over 100 views on some, on one of the videos or at least close to 100 views, then I'll probably then just move it strictly over to my new Facebook page that I have. So please make sure to, to check out the link um, in either my bot. And I'm gonna be posting a story on it uh, when this video comes out along with a link as well to my Facebook page. So if you don't wanna watch it on YouTube, you can always watch it on Facebook. Um, Pedro Fame there as well. So make sure to um, check out my videos there, get some views up, hit the like button there, um, comment what you guys think below. Please, it would help me out tremendously. I'm trying to get monetized any way I can so I could do this full time. So you guys can see more videos come out. I am super, super excited that I started this. Um, I know I've only posted one video so far. Another one is gonna be coming out today for you guys. So make sure to like and subscribe, but also remember, I mean, well, like and subscribe on YouTube, but on Facebook, make sure to like and view the video. Um, I am gonna be doing, uh, some unique videos are gonna be posted on to Facebook only, and I'll tell you guys what videos those are in the coming futures. I do have some specific videos that are only gonna go there, um, but pretty much a lot of it is gonna be retreaded videos that I've already posted on here, at least to start off, at least so I can start getting some fandom. Then afterwards, I'm going to get bigger and bigger and bigger um, with posting unique videos to there and then unique videos to to YouTube. So videos that I don't think that would do well on YouTube that could get me something on Facebook, I'll post it on Facebook and not post it on here. So, and I pretty much know what those videos are. Um, at this point, I have you know over 20,000 uh, views and videos. So I pretty much know what my audience would like to see. And I pretty much know what YouTube likes to see. So I'll do like the bigger videos will be on YouTube. Um, and then eventually they'll come out on Facebook. All videos are gonna come out on Facebook eventually, but for right now, it's not gonna be that starting out. It's gonna be a retread and then, um, it, it's gonna be like a, a close, it's probably a month delay between new videos coming out that I post on YouTube to Facebook, but I am gonna be posting um, videos unique videos on Facebook. So it's gonna be kind of a unique way of, of me doing it. You guys will see more. Um, I know talking about it is a little bit up and down, but you guys will see exactly what I'm talking about soon enough. But as you can see, as we get into this game, Sean Graves, 11 reception, 252 yards, four touchdowns. He is my number one wide receiver as he just caught a pass there. But as you guys can see, um, we're trying to lift the Auburn curse. Now, what I mean by Auburn curse is I am trying, because obviously as everybody knows, Auburn is in Alabama and um, they haven't really won any national championships. They've only won one, that was with Cam Newton. Other than that, they, they made it, but they haven't won it. Um, and they only made it, I, I'm gonna be honest with you, they shouldn't have, they just beat Alabama and they ended up getting the playoffs because of it. But pretty much that type of, that type of thing. So trying to lift what I would call the Auburn curse. So we will see if we can do so this year. I am trying to at least establish something nice for the future. Like I said, I don't expect us to go undefeated. I don't expect us to only lose one or even two games. Uh, we probably are gonna be around the three loss column here. Um, that's just honestly the truth. And as you can see, Mississippi State scored as well. So we're gonna see how good we could get um, and how far we go. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know how f how good we're gonna be this season in terms of um, if we're gonna get what bowl we're gonna make. I'm hoping we can make at least a New York Six Bowl, 
That is my real dream goal is to be part of one of the bigger bowls this season. I believe that can happen, especially with our strength of schedule and, and the wins that we are going to get. I think for sure that, that is certainly possible because we're going to beat a couple of ranked teams. I don't think we're going to beat all of our ranked teams. Like I said, Alabama's definitely, we're definitely not going to beat them. We don't have nearly a good enough team to go out there and, and spin Alabama. So, but as you can see, John Austin's four for 485 yards. He's been, he's come out phenomenal today. I don't know what's gotten into him. And my running game has been pretty good so far. Jared Foster has been pretty good. And you can see the upset alert down below. Let's see who's on upset alert. Kansas State is on upset alert. So, uh, by UMass. I don't think that's going to last very long. But you never know. And the more losses the ranked teams we get, the better chance it is for us to make to get ranked. And that is still the goal, to get ranked. We need to get on the national radar more. So to do that, we need to get ranked. And I think that happens... Probably after our fourth one. I think beating Mississippi State, but I think we're gonna need one more to get to get ranked. So um but I think once we start five and oh we're we're definitely gonna be there. Or four and oh, I'm sorry. I think we'll we'll get there. Right now we're not we're two and oh. Um soft schedule to begin with so far anyways, so I didn't really expect us to be near ranked right now. Oof, turnover, but I believe in our defense. Let's see here. We got the ball back. Like I said, I believe in our. I believe in our offense. Honestly, our offense, our offense played pretty well. Uh, Kent State beating LSU ten to nothing right now. That's big time. Oof, drop pass. Four of eight now because a bunch of drop passes. After starting off four and four, going 0 oh and four, my next four. Not good, but we should. We'll, we'll be fine. I think we're definitely going to beat Mississippi State. Uh, like I said, we're just still, we're not even, we haven't even scratched the surface, I feel like, yet. Oh, I totally saw Baker there. St tell me how, tell me how that even happened, bro. I don't even know how I even allowed that to even attempt it. But we'll see how we can go forward with it. Damn. They scored a tutty on us. So let's see what we can do here. Let's see if we can snatch the momentum back with some dominating run plays here. Ooh, get off me. Let's go. 11 yards, baby. Let's go. He was the five rushes, 52 yards. My man is on fire. One of that football. Six first downs, each of us with Mississippi State obviously having a lead here. Ten and a, I mean, 10 to 7. Ah, come on. Let's run that back. See if I can get Sean Graves to get one one. Oh, good job by the corner to get there. Four of ten. Wow, six straight incomplete passes right now. So not good. I'm gonna do a speed option. No, I know it's not the smartest play, but right now we just need something. Oh god, fumble. Jesus. Connecticut losing to Maryland, 14 to nothing there. Penn State beating UCF, three zip. Outset alert, UMass. UMass is coming to play, bro. You know what I mean? 13 to 10. You gotta stop playing with these boys. You gotta stop playing with Mississippi State. We're, we're getting killed right now. And we can't run the football. So we are in a lot of trouble. Now using a lot of trouble. 10 nothing still. Oh, 
We need to get something going for our team. I think we will on this play here. Yep. Got something going. Perfect job. And Kansas State scores touchdown, so they're back up on UMass. Sweet option again. Let's do it. Good stuff. Hey, good stuff. Let's see if we can get some good score out of this. Come on, bro. Why would you run that route like that? to even allow myself to get picked off. Fuck. All right. Sheesh, we're getting killed like that. Look at they only got field goals out of it, but come on, man. We gotta play better than this. Thank God Sean Graves got open. Oof. I burst the one, but I couldn't get the other one. 51 yards, though, so perfect perfect job getting downfield. See if we can get to the outside, get Foster out in space. See if we can get him some running lanes here. Hey, got some good yards. Six yards there. It's a good run for us. LSU still down 10 to nothing. Not good for them at all. Let's see what we can do. Third and four. All right, fine. Third and four. Let's see if we can get a slant over the middle. Let's me pick up a first down and keep the chains moving here. As we desperately need some yardage. Hey, good stuff. And then same play back over again. Let's go. Come on. Run it again. Yep, and bass again. Let's go. Touchdown, baby. Let's go. We're up one. Let's go. Great touchdown throw there. Put this back up with the lead. Let's see. Hopefully we don't have to squeak this game uh, by. And we can just get a convincing win in regular time. We're doing pretty good so far. We're holding Mississippi State pretty well. Um, on by our defense. I mean, our defense is going phenomenal so far. Let's see what we can do here. We're getting some good yardage, though, in the run game compared to other times that we've rushed the football where we haven't done so well. So I'm pretty happy so far with the run game. Would I like a little bit more yards? Of course. But I think we're doing all right. Passing-wise, you know, that's where we continue. To have our pitfalls, as you can see. Oh, let's go, Woods. And we're taking a timeout there. Upset alert is continuing. Oh, LSU finally scored. Made it 7 10 against Kent State. Uh, let's see if we can get a score here, guys. Let's see. I don't, I can't guarantee, it, especially the way our team has played lately, but we could. And a touchdown. Let's go. Auburn Tigers. Two touchdowns, two interceptions so far. Put us up eight, so they're going to need two point conversion when they score. Penn State down 21, 21 to three against UCF. But let's go here. I'm 
seven feet. There you go, buddy. Jeez. All right. Third quarter, fourth and 14. We got the ball. Let's see what we can do here. Great job uh, running the football. I'm so glad we're up, too. I think we're going to do a great job of winning some football games here. Especially if we can continue getting the run game going. That is so key for us, is the run game. Because that ability to run the football consistently helps us out tremendously in the back end. Helps us out when we're, we're doing anything, doing anything, honestly. It helps out a lot. And we have wooden pass. Let's see if we can get somebody open here. And we did. Oh, bass. You got to catch that, brother. You got to catch that. You know what that, that type of thing does to our morale. Come on. That's right. We still got, we still got some slants up our sleeve. Especially if we can put Bath in the Nugget. Put Baker in a tough position to guard who? Yep, didn't guard the right one. Got Bass. 350 plus yards of offensive yardage. Passed for over 250 yards. Let's see if I can get a quarterback draw. See if I can get some yardage. Hopefully, Baker doesn't see. I don't know. I think he might. Nope, he didn't see it this time. Three yards though. Hey, three yards, three yards. We need it. We just need to get something on this. Let's see if we can get Graves over the middle. Yep, we did. Ah, I'll see if I can cut it and get in there. LSU up on Kent State, fourteen ten. Do a shovel. Good job. That was the perfect, perfect pitch. Right before he hits me, pitch the ball out to ya boy Jared Foster with another touchdown. And we are up now by 15 points. So I think we can go ahead and say we got this in the Erg. Let's see. Skip here. Let's go again. Our ball. Man, we just keep getting the ball back. What? 263 versus 376. We killing them. We killing them. Why? Why? Every time I do that, I always ended up doing something stupid when I click onto the guy. And I didn't even click to redo the play, but whatever. It's fine anyways, because I want I want to redo anyways. But I don't know how to keep it. But I used to have Jared Foster if I need to. Ooh. Let's go to Jared. Oh, third and three. Not bad. Not bad at all. Can't get mad. Can't get mad. See if we can get a good run in here for the first down. Like I said, Mississippi State hasn't been able to score a touchdown since the very beginning. And they've been zeroed out here in the third quarter. So we could potentially get a very good job here. We have one more first down them, 15 to 14. Uh, so let's see if we can... Get them mixed up. Oof. Tipped off his hands. 283 yards, two touchdowns, two interceptions so far. So let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can get the run game going a little bit more. With Foster. And it looks like we did. Got five yards on it. Hey, that's all we needed to make a short third down. 14 rushes for 105 yards. That is awesome sauce to see. See who we have on the outside. We have Graves up oh, in the third quarter. 
I was about to agree for a D boy. Let's see. We're still up. Like I said, 28-13. No biggie. Plus, we still have Woods and Graves going over that middle. So let's see what we get. Oh, man. He obliterated that play. Okay. Baker again, dude. That guy is obliterating plays for me. Um... Definitely gonna go for it here. Let's see what play I can come up with. To get us a nice first down. How about the only how about the play that always works for me? And I got Buckley and Bass to to be in on it. Whew. Yes sir! And he broke a couple tackles. 27 yard reception by Travis. Bass, seven receptions, 122 yards, and a touchdown. Isaiah really keyed in on Graves, so that's probably why you don't see Graves with very much yardage, because he's just unable to get much. Five receptions, 128 yards, though, so it's pretty good yardage right there, I'd say myself. Especially for a guy who was getting the number one player on him and, and getting safety help over the top. So, another first down for Sean Graves there. Six receptions, 139 yards. Could he be looking to go over 150 today? 333 yards by the quarterback already. Touchdown! And that's Bass. 338 passing yards. Three touchdowns, two interceptions. 17 of 29. And that's going to be the game, folks. So I'm going to go ahead and sim it to the end, as that is likely it. Stanford and Army at 20, 28 apiece. Oh, boy. This is getting interesting here, as the, Car as the Cardinals are doing that. No, oh, oh, whatever, because I already did it. Um. And of course, they're going to run it out. Couldn't just leave it alone. That's going to be it for today, guys. Uh, no, it's going to be it for this game, I'm sorry. We are, like I said, this is a double header um, episode, so don't forget to like and subscribe. And we're going to go ahead and sim to the end of the game. It's over. We're up big time on him. Oh, 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 actually. Uh, let's just... Looks like we had to actually play. They were coming back on us. <laughs> I can't lose this game, you know what I mean? Uh, not if I want to keep this dream alive. But why did our defense allow them to score? I mean, we're right here anyways. We can always score a touchdown. It's not that big of a deal. 488 yards versus 427. They started coming back, though. I ain't going to come gap. That kind of scared me. And I guess we didn't do good in the red zone one time, so not good for us. Kansas State, 45. UMass, 30. Even though UMass gave him hell. Tepe. And we won. Let's go, baby. Got a good dub today. Won the game. Travis Bass, player of the game. Nine receptions, 128 yards, and two touchdowns. Three and O oh to start off the season. So let's hope we can continue that run. Like I said, once we get to 4 and O, oh, I think we'll definitely see that. Oh, oh shoot. Let's go to player stats and see how we did. 339 yards, three touchdowns, two interceptions. They had 382 yards, two touchdowns. That, that, that could be great. The running game did pretty all right. Our running game did better because we got a junior in Jared Foster, who's phenomenal. And we only have Park Foster and John Houston. So that's what I'm saying. We don't even have that good of a quarterback, guys. And we are... And we got a nice win over Mississippi State. So, 
progression there. Let's see what we can do. See if we can get another, another win. And depending on who it is, I might sim it. Depending on who it is, though. Don't, don't quote me on that, guys. Don't quote me on that. You know what I'm saying? Out of sight, even progress. Okay. So we got LSU next. Oh, gosh. There we go. Got some well-needed upgrades. We got the recruit ready to visit. This recruit ready to visit. So a left tight, a left end, I'm sorry, and a tight end. Two positions we could definitely use. Number eight, LSU is coming to Auburn. I'm just kidding. We're going to the swamp. And it's our opener. I guess we're not allowed to do anything right now. So all 5,000 was used. So let's see what we can do. You could upgrade me. Alright, so that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for watching my video, and make sure to click subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell for you guys to see more. See you guys in the next one.